Okay, so here is the problem today. We have this interesting algebra problem. I would say relaxing algebra problem. Yeah, so we have four plus four times four divided by four and plus four. So as you can see, as the same numbers, we have division, we have multiplication and addition. Yeah, so a lot of students solve it in the wrong order of operation. They make this common mistake. They start, for example, with this addition or with this one. They divide it first or they multiply it first. So as you can see, many combination of this order of operation. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to solve it correctly with order of operation. So the main popular order of operation in the world, this is PMDMC order of operation. You can easily check this order of operation. For example, the most popular uh, library, mass library, this is Wolfram Alpha. You can easily check this PMDMC. Wolfram Alpha, Alpha works according to PMDMC order of operation. And of course, we need to solve it correctly according to PMDMC. So I just rewrite this problem. So 4 plus 4 times 4 divided by 4 and plus four, yeah? So we have this question right here. So what what we need to start with is to, according to PMDMC. So we need to scan, okay, the first step is this parentheses. So we go from the top to the bottom. This is our first step. And of course, before you can easily write your option in a comment section. So what do you think is a correct answer? It will be really interesting to check our answer in the end of the video. So A, 12 or 16, we will check our answer, yeah? So you can easily write your option down in a comment section, okay? Because obviously, whatever order we select is going to create a different answer, right? So we need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem, yeah? So what if this is our order? So the first step parentheses. So are there any parentheses right here? No, I don't see any of those. So we skip this part. Exponents. We have we don't have any squares, cubes right here. So we just we just really great. We just skip this part as well. The next step, multiplication. But a lot of students do this common mistake. They say, okay, multiplication. Now let's multiply this four times four. But multiplication and division works as one group. So we need to scan where do we have multiplication and division. So we have the addition. This is not good. Right here we have multiplication. And this is division. So addition, adi multiplication and division part we have right here in the middle. Yeah. So let's solve it according to PMDMC. And now multiplication and division part. We need to scan what is the first sign from left to right in this case. Multiplication division right here. What is the first sign from left to right? The first sign from left to right is this multiplication. So we need to multiply it first. Yeah. So let's multiply. So 4 times 4 equal to 16. 16. And we rewrite this division. So divided by 4 and plus 4. I rewrite this right here in the end and 4 from here. Yeah. So we multiply it first, then we need to scan what is the first sign from left to right, because we still have this division part. So the first sign and only one sign is this division. So 16 divided by 4 equal to equal to 4. So we have like 4 from the in the beginning 4. So 4 plus 4 plus 4 equal to equal to 12. Yeah, this is a solution to this to this problem, according to PMDMC, of course. A lot of students and uh, do this common mistake. They start with this addition. It looks like 8 times 4 is 32. This is, looks like 8 plus 4. This is the same 12. A lot of students start with this division, with this division. And as you can see, a lot of combination. But the correct answer to this problem, this is this PMDMC order. And correct answer is option, option, option B. I, I hope your answer is the same as mine. But definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong. If you made this error, I'm happy you made this because you won't make this again. So definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong. Okay, now if you need to learn basic math, interesting brain tests, different IQ question, you enhance your brain level, you want to pass your algebra test, you can easily subscribe to my channel. I have a lot of interesting brain tests and yeah, I hope you, you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. I wish you all the best in your mathematical adventures. Thank you for your time and have a great day.